Yo, what's going on? Hope you're having a great day. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to set up your MIDI controller in Studio One. This is going to be a really, really quick, simple video that's going to show you exactly what you need so that you can start using your keyboard in Studio One and start making those banging beats. So stick through to the end. Now, if you don't know who I am, I'm Jay Carter Ray from jaycarteray.com, teaching you how to be better at music, online business, and online marketing. This is the number one spot for musicians and creators that don't want to be starving. Artists. So if that sounds like you, click on that subscribe button check out the rest of the content on the channel because you will love it here guaranteed now my question of the day is what kind of music are you making in studio one let me know in the comment section down below i think that'll be super super interesting so i have just loaded up an instrument i'll make a video on how to do that if you haven't done that already or you don't know how to do that and i've also connected my keyboard like so so you can see that yes I have connected my keyboard and I do know how to do that. Okay, so I'm gonna quickly show you how to do that. All you need to do is go to Studio One up here, go to Options, go to External Devices, then you need to go to Add, then you go to New Keyboard. Here you can name your keyboard, you can write the manufacturer and all that sort of stuff. I'm just gonna write Test right here and we're gonna name this Test Two, and then what you need to do after this is round here these are the two selections that are important so down here you'll have a drop down menu where you can now pick your keyboard now your keyboard does need to be plugged into your computer and your computer needs to recognize it at this point so i just recently reset windows and i didn't install anything from my keyboard or anything like that so your keyboard should work as soon as you plug it in okay it should be recognized so down here we've got my keyboard the umx and okay we can't actually do that <laughs> it's telling us you can't do that basically so i'm not gonna go to okay when we're done but basically you want to set this as whichever keyboard you're using set the receive from and go to the send to and select whatever keyboard you're using so i'm gonna click cancel at the end of this but that is exactly how you set up a keyboard and that's how i set up this keyboard and how i'm able to play an instrument on in studio one with my keyboard that's how it's done so very very straightforward very very easy but if you want to learn how to make a complete beat from scratch you can join my free course it's a free gift for you right now link is down below or go to jcarteray.com forward slash free trap course i highly suggest you join this course as soon as possible because it won't be available forever so make sure to take advantage of this opportunity and join that course so you can learn how to make a beat completely from scratch to the end using my easy nine step trap beat making formula sign up now and I'll see you inside there. Now, if you've got any questions or any other tutorials you want me to make, please let me know in the comment section down below. And in the next video, you're gonna learn more about music, online business, and online marketing. I'll see you there. Peace out.